only way you know how, completely and forever. Please face each other for your vows. Michael, do you have this woman to be your lawful wedded wife to live together in the state of matrimony? I do. Do you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, keep you only unto her as long as you both shall live? I do. Rhonda, do you have this man to be your lawful wedded husband to live together in the state of matrimony? I do. Do you love him, <laughs> comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, forsaking all others, keep you only unto him as long as you both shall live? We'll now have the exchanging of the rings. Michael, place the ring on Rhonda's finger. Repeat after me. I, Michael. I, Michael. Take you, Rhonda. Take you, Rhonda. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and cherish. To love and cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a token of my love. As a token of my love. And a symbol of our future together. And a symbol of our future together. I promise to live with you. I promise to live with you. And laugh with you. And laugh with you. To stand by your side. To stand by your side. In the good times and the bad times. In the good and the bad. To be a joy to your heart. To be a joy to your heart. And to share with you. To share with you. All that I have from now. All that I have from now. Until the end of my life. Until the end of my life. Rhonda, place this ring. Repeat after me. I, Rhonda. I, Rhonda. Take you, Michael. Take you, Michael. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and cherish, till death do us part. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. It's a token of my love and a symbol of our future together. I promise to live with you. And to laugh with you, and to, laugh with you. <laughs> to stand by your side <laughs> in the good times and the bad times, to be a joy to your heart, and to share with you all that I have from now until the end of my life. As you join hands, I'm going to tell you about the symbolism of the wedding rings. From the earliest of times, the circle's been a symbol of completeness a symbol of committed love. An unbroken, never-ending circle symbolizes a commitment to love that is also never-ending. So as often as you look upon the symbol of these wedding rings, I hope you'll be reminded of this commitment to love each other forever that you have made today. As you face each other holding hands, you feel the gift that you are to one another. These are the hands of your best friend, young and strong and full of love for you, that are holding yours on your wedding day as you promise to love each other today, tomorrow, and forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours as together you build your future. These are the hands that will passionately love you and cherish you through the years, and with the slightest touch will comfort you like no other. These are the hands that will hold you when fear or grief wraps your mind. These are the hands that with countless time wipe tears from your eyes tears of sorrow and tears of joy. These are the hands that will tenderly hold your children. These are the hands that will help hold your family as one. These are the hands that will give you strength when you most need it. And lastly, these are the hands that even when wrinkled in age someday will still be reaching for yours and still give you that same unspoken tenderness with just a touch. For as much as Rhonda and Michael have consented together in matrimony and have witnessed the same before this company and have declared the same by giving and receiving rings and by joining hands, by the power vested in me by the laws of the state of Connecticut, I now pronounce you wedded, husband, and wife. You may kiss the bride.
Ha 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 ha!